What's the scoop, my J Rock stars? J Rock X is back in the building, you already know. Here we are. Uh, no, wait, no, wait a second. Here we are. The final duel of the Battle City Tournament Yugi versus Merrick. Let's get right into it. The time has come for the final face off Yugi versus Merrick, with the fate of the world hanging in the balance. I've been waiting for this moment my entire life. Soon your eternal power will be mine. Merrick, not only will I defeat you, I will free the darkness that you that controls you. <laughs> now that I'd like to see. <laughs> oh my goodness, there's not a whole bunch of dialogue here. I like this. I like this fight. I'll do this fight over and over and over again. Ah. Oh. So, for everybody out there, Happy New Year. I don't even care that I don't care. New Year, we still picking rock. We never change. Well, I'll go second. That's fine. Yami Yugi versus Yami Merrick. Single move, round one. Let's get it. I only have one fusion monster. Notice that he doesn't have any. And I've got to chill. I probably should have wore a hoodie. Monsters cannot attack the turn that they are summoned. Hmm. That's different. Touch or summon one metal fiend token. It cannot attack. Your opponent your your opponent takes any da battle damage you would have taken from battle involving it. During each main phase, pay a thousand life points or destroy this token. Hot shit. So that's a good thing and a bad thing. Soul Taker. Target one face up monster your opponent controls. Destroy that monster, then your opponent gains one thousand life points. Well that kinda sucks. Alright, so let's do this. I really should go on the offensive since I'm I'm going second, but I'm gonna hold off and Dark Paladin is what's in. Okay. Whoops. Drop some drumstick. I feel like in every video I'm knocking something over or I'm dropping some revival jam. Are you kidding me? You're not serious right now, are you, bruh? Bruh. Alright, let me think, let me think, let me think. So I could get rid of that and then um, give him a thousand life points. Text message. Um, when this card is destroyed by battle and sent to the graveyard. When it is destroyed by battle and sent to the graveyard. That is something I did not know. So I could get rid of that card. Oh my goodness. Text message. <laughs> Phone, you're not helping me think right now. Um. Uh, let me think. Let me think. Let me think. Uh, all right. I can't do anything to turn that the card is summoned anyway. So let's do this. Queen's knight. King's knight. Jack's Knight. Alright, so I have all of these here. I can't do anything this turn because they were all summoned this turn. But, my defenses are up. And I do plan on attacking next turn. You destroyed each other? Why would you do that? That's what summon it. Face up defense mode during your next standby phase. Why? I don't. Okay. I guess it. I guess it actually does make sense why you would do that. But still, I wouldn't have done that. That was stupid. <laughs> then it has to target one face up monster. Damn! I should have used this when I had the chance. All right, let's bring this up. Can't attack this turn. What's that do? I'm gonna take away all your life points just because of revival jams. Like for real. I'm gonna set this down. I'm gonna end my turn. They said by your standby phase, put it in face up defense mode. So does that mean that you can't change his battle position right now? 
Yeah, you can't change his battle position. So I could get rid of one of them if I wanted to. I have what? I'm not doing that. <laughs> I could, but I'm not going to. No, I'm not going to do it. So let's do this. Let me get rid of one. He gains his life points, but he can't can't bring it back. So can I use this? Can I use this? Attack defensive. I, I don't. I don't really care. I'm thinking dark magician girl or red eyes black dragon. I can't attack the turn that I summon this thing anyway. Let's let's do Dark Magician Girl. I get rid of the Metal Fiend token. Go ahead, use the ability. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna kill your life points because you're gonna, you're gonna keep on using that ability. I already know it. I'm not letting you summon the fucking Wing Dragon Raw. I'm I'm not letting it happen. <laughs> I'm hoping that I can end this turn. Or in this duel next turn. Alright, go ahead and bring go ahead, yeah, go ahead, go ahead, bring it back. We're cool with that. Got another face down card. I just won this duel. I so just I so just won this duel. During either player's turn when this card is face down, the Son, I won the duel. Let me get the music ready. Only in ten turns, about to turn up, son. Hey, what'd you say? Uh, Master Merrick, brother, please tell me you're all right. Merrick, it's over. Your evil side has been banished forever. It's finally over? My pharaoh. Yes, the darkness was lifted from your heart. Merrick has overpowered the... Wait, wait, what? Merrick has overpowered the evil that controlled him for so long. No, he didn't. The pharaoh did that. <laughs> what are you talking about? He just said it. We did it. I wouldn't have been... I wouldn't have been victorious had it not been for all of you. Pharaoh... Rest assured that everyone who was banished from the Shadow Realm, ah, uh, to the Shadow Realm, by my dark side will return. Thank you. I have one more task to perform before my Tomb Keeper's mission is complete. Witness the secret power. Witness the secret to the Pharaoh's power inscribed in my back. These marks, these markings are passed down by my family from generation to generation for 5,000 years. Goddamn. We were taught that we we were taught that when the, we in, <laughs> we were taught that when the ancient pharaoh saved the world from destruction, he wiped his own mind clear. But he knew that someday he would return and he would need his memory back. So he entrusted one of his family's greatest secrets, the key to unlocking his mind and his power. Now look at Yugi's face in the background. What the fuck? He's so damn smiley. <laughs> <laughs> Why is he so cheesing back there? Now that you hold the three Egyptian God cards and the Millennium Puzzle, all all you need to do is read the words of Merrick's back. You're so close. It's time to it's time for us to leave now, Pharaoh. Please take this. The Millennium Rod belongs to you, where it won't cause any more harm. Thank you. Wait, hold on. What about the Millennium Ring? And take this as well. The Millennium Ring is sacred with you. Oh, okay. There it is. There it is. With Yugi now possessing all the Millennium items, possessing all the Millennium items and three Egyptian God cards, he could now make sure that the Shadow Games would never return. Hold on, he doesn't possess all of the Magician, Millen, magi, Magician, wow, Millennium God pieces. He doesn't have Millennium puzzle, Millennium items. Jesus, I can't speak. He doesn't have, um, he doesn't have the Millennium Eye. 
the girl still has her Millennium Necklace, and there's a Millennium Balance or something like that. I know that that's in this game. I don't know who has that or whatever. But this is it right here. This is the last duel, the final duel. Let's let's go ahead and jump into it. Now the Pharaoh. Now the Pharaoh saved the world. There was one last task. There was one last thing he had to do. Move on to the afterlife. Guided by Merrick, Shuze, and Autumn. I don't know how to say that fucker's name. Uh, the team went to went to a sacred underground temple to house the gateway of the afterlife. To open the door, the Pharaoh had to seal away the Egyptian god cards and seven millennium items and have one final duel, a ritual duel against Yugi. The duel would determine whether Yugi could now stand on his own as stand on his own as his own man or not and not need the Pharaoh's help anymore. This is the first time in my life that I have hopes for my opponent's victory. But in order for this duel to be truly to truly test our readless read, 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 readless readiness I don't know why I was struggling with that just now. To separate, I must fight with all of my strength. Pharaoh, now that you now that you left the Millennium Puzzle, I can't hear your I can't hear your thoughts anymore. But somehow I still know that you're I still know what you're thinking, and I feel the same way. If you taught me anything, it's to put my heart into the deck and duel with everything that I've got. That's exactly what I'm going to do. Here we go. Yugi versus Yama Yugi. The final duel is right here. And like always, we gonna pick rock. I don't even care that you pick paper. I should have picked scissors just because it was the last one. Oh my goodness. We're gonna try and do this as fast as possible. We're gonna try and do this duel as fast as possible. I would love to take my time. But what the hell is that? Is that Red Eyes Metal Dragon? What is that? Oh! Gondor, the Dragon of Destruction. Cannot be special summoned. You pay half of your life points, destroy all... What? You can pay half of your life points, destroy all other cards on the field, and if you do, banish them. This card gains 300 attack for each card destroyed this way. During the end phase of the turn that this card was summoned, send it to the graveyard. That can be a good thing, but can also be a shitty thing. What? Hey! My Silent Swordsman! I love those cards. Alright, I'm gonna do... I'm gonna do something different than what I've ever done before. I'm going to start on the attack. So let's bring out the Gamma Warrior. Gamma Magnet Warrior. Nice. Okay. I'm gonna end my turn right there. Hold on, let me check something. There we go. Oh shit, I wasn't even paying attention. I was looking at my computer. Katona wants to declare an attack. How is the Dark Magician out here? Pay half your life points, special summon one Dark Magician from your deck. It cannot, you cannot summon other monsters the turn you activate this, but you can set. Oh, okay. Yeah, fuck you. I'm not, I'm not I don't even care. I don't even, I don't even care. Monster reincarnation shit. Here, only here because what is this? It's a field spell card. Oh, once for oh my god, the chill. I need, I really need to put on a hoodie. Once per turn, if a monster you control would be destroyed by battle, you can send one rock type monster from your deck to your graveyard instead. That's a field spell, am I right? It is. I don't, uh, one rock, yeah, one rock type. Your machine, your rock. Okay, so that'd be sending like my my magnet warriors to the to the graveyard. Okay. This card is like a heavy ass risk, man. I don't even want to think about bringing this card to the field. Um. Yeah, what needs to happen in order for me, in order for me to bring out level seven? I used to use these shits all the time. Stand by face after this card inflicts damage to your opponent by a direct attack. You can 
and send this face up card. Okay, that's how you get level seven. Got it. Um, sure. Let's normal summon this. Do I have any of the other gadgets? Oh, I do. I was not expecting that, but okay. I'm gonna use Gamma War to hit this card. I knew it. I knew it was the King's Knight. I don't know how I knew that, but I felt it. I felt it. I knew it. Alright, we're gonna end the turn right there. Oh shit, wait. I should not need to do that. If all the monsters in your graveyard are Earth, you can tribute this card to target. You can tribute this card to target two level four lower type monsters, uh, rock type monsters in your graveyard, except for a block golem, which this is this card, right? Especially some of those, but their effects cannot be activated. Okay, it's good to know. Hmm. I know, right? I'm looking at that. And now, how do you special summon this? By tributing one Alpha the Magnet. Oh, by tributing all of them from your hand and side of the field. You can tribute this card. You can tribute this card to target one Alpha, Beta, or Gamma Warrior in your graveyard. Special summon those. Hmm. Okay. So wait, do I still take damage? I do still take damage. Okay, that's something I did not know. How much are you? 1600? Can I bring this? I can bring this to the field now. It's not a good idea. Alright, let's go summon skull. We're gonna take away the yellow magnet warrior. Whoa, wait! You're not ground, are you? Well, I won't be using that ability that way. I said ground, I'm gonna say earth. Get rid of you. It's your face down card, Yugi. Show it to me. Show me, bitch. These cards, silent, silent swordsman. I used to love these level cards. I never really liked the arm dragon level cards, but what was my favorite? My favorite was um, it was a fire dragon type. I uh, can't believe that I can't remember it right now. Oh my goodness, I cannot believe that the card's name is not on my... Are you serious? I've been sitting here chit-chatting this whole time. I just, just now looked at Yugi's life points. Yo, is it really a wrap? Is this the last time for this series we're gonna hear this music? Play it out for me, cuz! Play it out for me, cuz! That's right, I kept going, I hit the note. What you want? Congratulations, well done. Yugi, you have achieved the you have achieved a great victory for us both. I was focusing so hard on playing the game that I forgot that what winning this duel would naturally mean. By defeating you, I've sent you away for good. No. You have opened the door for me. Thanks to you, my spirit can finally rest once again. I'll be back. Wait, what? I'll be back where where I belong. Oh, never mind. I was going <laughs> I'll be back. <laughs> um, fate brought the two of us together for a reason, and we fulfilled our destiny. We'll protect mankind from returning from the return of the Shadow Games, and we've both grown tremendously among the way, along the way. I said among the way, along the way. I'm gonna miss you. Do you realize you'll never truly? Do you realize we'll never truly be apart? Right? The gift of kindness you've given me, and the and the courage I've given you will remain with us, and that will forever bond us together. Right! <laughs> Why is it like that? <laughs> oh my, oh, I'm sorry. You just got so hyped there, it was funny. 
Now the battle, <laughs> now the battle ritual is complete. The eye of Widjat, what the fuck? That guards the door, uh, that guards the door to the spirit world has awakened, and the spirit of the great pharaoh, which was trapped within the Millennium Puzzle for five thousand years, is now free. The time has arrived. Eye of the, <laughs> tell the eye of Widjat your name. I am the son of King Ak. Aknam Kunan? My name is Atim. Damn, son. Damn. There's the achievement. King of Games. Defeat the classic campaign. Defeated classic campaign. Yeah. <sighs> They're reverse duels. Look at all of these reverse duels, man, that I got to go back here and do. But we did it, guys. We beat it before the New Year's. Happy New Year's to all of you guys. When we come back, why does it say that the series is not all the way complete? Oh, because I got to do the reversals. That's right. Um, when we come back, I'll have all these reversals dual done, dual done, dual done. I'll have all of these reverse duels done. Hopefully, maybe not. We'll see. Um, but we're going to jump into GX. And woo, am I not really looking forward to that? The next king of games. Jesus Lord. Elemental heroes. There's a lot of parallelizations. Polymerizations. I don't know why I keep saying parallel. There's a lot of polymerizations in this series. There's a lot of polymerization in these series. And this is 5Ds. This is all about synchro summoning. This is like the XYZ. I don't really know what the Arch V was. I know the color of the card. I think the color of the card is like black, but I just don't remember. Well, guys, thank you so much again. I will, um, I'm going to get up out of here. And I guess I need to go to work. Maybe I'll get like two or three hours of sleep. <laughs> two or three hours of sleep. I'm just kidding. I know. I, I never sleep. I'm going to do do more work anyway. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. Wow, I can't speak English. Make sure you hit the like button. Share with your friends and all that other cool stuff. Make sure you subscribe for some more. We're going to continue to go with this. I don't really know how long it's going to take us to get through this series. Um, when you think about the last one, we started in the middle of September, and now it's New Year's, and we're just finishing. Hopefully, the next one doesn't take as long, but I mean, we'll see. We'll see. This is one of the games that I definitely, 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 definitely want to beat. Like, I love Yu-Gi-Oh! I definitely don't want it to, like, go away from my life. I used to play the card game all the time and get my ass beat. But I used to also beat some ass in the, um, pause on that. I used to also win some duels <laughs> in the process. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. Everybody, take care. Be safe. Peace.